Ladies and gentlemen, this is the video preview of this uh, new Stricom unit, which is the uh, FC12. This is classified as an high-end home entertaining system. Uh, the dimensions, as you can see, are 420 of width, 320 of depth, and 175 millimeters height, 184 including the feet. Um, this is a very interesting unit also because it can host all the ATX standards. It has a 4mm thick premium grade extruded aluminum panel and sandblasted with a sandblast finish. And uh, as you can see it's, it's very cool and very good looking cabinet. Um, it has also an upper mounting rail for fans and uh, water cooling radiators in the inside, as we can see right uh, soon. But it has also a side panel venting system for high cooling potential, for a very high cooling potential, because these fan filters are um, specifically um, engineered uh, against dust while maximizing the airflow, and uh, they are also easily cleanable. You can easily remove them as we can see, uh, as uh, we'll see um, in a couple of minutes. Um, apart this, um, um, it's a very uh, adaptable and uh, configurable chassis. But right now, let's have a look at the inside of this cabinet. About the fan filters. You can see that there are four magnets that hold a fan filter and um, um, metal mesh, uh, a metal uh, side um, plate that holds the, the filter itself. Um, it is possible in the inside to place a radiator, and specifically of uh, 240mm right here, or even a 120mm, so it's very versatile as you can see. In the upper part, it's possible to remove such uh, filters, so you can install a variety of uh, systems and uh, fans. Let's have a look at the cabinet from behind. You can see that uh, there's a PSU in the, in the back. And um, about the PSU, you need to know that uh, um, you can. Um, there is no limit about the length of this uh, unit. For example, let's have a look with the cable management system. Sorry. Okay. And uh, as you can see, uh, the this is a 150 um, 1500 watts um, unit from Silverstone. It is a, it has an 80 plus gold unit, and um, as you can see, there is plenty of space. But let's have a look in the inside. You just need to remove the upper plates with a, a system that it's a bit complex. Because oh right, it was the, the opposite way, sorry. Just a bit. Alright. Here we go. You need to lift off this element so we can see the inside. Just for the purpose of this test, we've installed a 240 millimeter radiator in the upper part for the CPU. This is a um, uh, GTX 480 Sly solution, but obviously you can install uh, all the uh, models, for example also the R9290 or 390 AMD cards. 
there isn't any problem regarding the tolerance um, uh, because of the, the, the depth, the length of the these VGAs. Um, they are also uh, very um, um, well ventilated because, uh, as you can see, there was a, a, a front panel with a vent, so uh, they take uh, a lot of air from the upper part of the cabinet, so you won't have so many hot spots. Uh, in the inside, as you can see, so we could have a, a single VGA with a 120 mm radiator, uh, VGA1, for example, this model from RT Cooling, just a second, for example, we could install this model right here and uh, uh, with a, a water pump right on the uh, this VGA, for example. And uh, so uh, there are very uh, there are a lot of possibilities uh, regarding the cooling potential of the units inside this cabinet. As you can see, this is a 1500 watts PSU from Silverstone, and there's plenty of space. Here we have installed uh, an HDD, which is a 3.5 inches hard drive, and uh, it's um, it has a very peculiar uh, system uh, to to mount them. Because it uh, you need to uh, position uh, these uh, these um, structures that goes straight on the side panel. As you can see, there's a, a, a placement right there for these uh, units. So in short, this is just a preview. So uh, we suggest you to to have a look on uh, our written review, which is in Italian, but you can translate it in uh, with Google Translator. This is a very power powerful cabinet. For example, um, as you can see right here, there is a flare uh, connector, and uh, so you can uh, even. Uh, use any remote with your media center for example turning turning uh, this uh, machine into something that in your house could uh, show movies or even on YouTube or even gaming like a console which is a very interesting concept uh, you can install uh, for example up to seven uh, drives which are uh, 24 2.5 inches or 12 3.5 inches. Uh, but uh, obviously you you need to understand that if there's plenty of space, you also need to configure this space accordingly to the uh, motherboard uh, ATX standard. For example, this is a Rampage 4 Extreme, um, and so uh, it has a um, uh, E80X standard, which is uncommon. Uh, we highly suggest you to utilize a um, micro ATX board with a single VGA. So, for example, you can have a liquid cooling system on the CPU and a liquid cooling system on the VGA. You can even install probably also a GDX uh, 980 Ti or the uh, Polaris or the Pascal ones that will be released at the end of uh, this month. So in short, let us know what you think about this unit, but also uh, to our written review of this um, Stricom F12C cabinet. Thank you.